second. Anyway, we're supposed to get loaded now. Thank God. I, I like these uh, self loads at the port because it, I mean it's quick. You know, you pull in, you give them the paperwork, back up to the ramp, find your tractors, get them on your trailer, chain them down, and out out you go. So uh, yeah, we're we're gonna get loaded and get on the road. Like I said, we need to beat that storm system that's coming through. Uh, like i know it's going to be coming through like north tennessee kentucky uh in that area so let's get loaded get on the road
Check this out. It's got a little baby seat with a seat belt and everything. Ain't that just spiffy? This one's dead, guys. So I'm gonna have to wait for them. The guys are at lunch right now. And uh, so I just took it upon myself to find the serial number tractors or the, the tractors with the right serial numbers and pull them back there that way when they get here they can look over it i can back up get them loaded on the trailer and go so i gotta find one more tractor uh i haven't been able to find it yet and uh i'll have to wait they uh the trucks the little pickups that they have here at the port has the jumper cable built into onto the front of the truck so They'll have to come over and jump this tractor, and then we'll get it loaded. But right now, I need to find the other one. So, I was a little wrong. The uh, the other tractor I was looking for was a new haul, and I'd already found the case. So, uh, that one will go on first. This one, and that one up there that's dead will go on last. This one and that one that's dead will be my first stop, and then the case will be my second, will be my second stop. Dude, this thing's got a sunroof. Hey, these these tractors are nice. Like I said, it's got the little baby seat. Park and brake. You know, for anyone that don't know how to drive a tractor, uh, it's fairly simple. You want to make sure you're in neutral. Park and brake's on. And then this is your uh, gears. Make sure your gears are in neutral. Press the clutch. Start it. You have your uh, lever that operates your bucket. Up and down. And then left and right curls the bucket. Throw it in gear. You have that pedal right there, which is a gas pedal. I like doing this. I don't really use that. I use this lever right here, which is also the gas pedal. But yeah, throw it in gear, raise your bucket, throw it in forward. Kick your brake off, or in this case, I'm gonna throw it in reverse, and then let off the gas, and it'll go.
fairly simple. Like I said, I know there's some of you out there that don't know how to drive them. Uh, that driver never hauled tractors before. And then, if you can't see it, but on the other side of, like right beside, park right beside me, there's another driver. That's uh, never hauled tractors before, so. Give them a hand, help them out, show them where to tie down at. Uh, little things like that help other people out uh, that driver up there uh, you can't see him that driver up there don't have the ability to print his paperwork out so I told him if they tell him he has to have the printed paper to come see me uh, I'll have to use some of my old paper that's already printed on one side but I can print it out for him help him out like I said you now if you're gonna be doing stuff like this a lot of the ports require you to have the paperwork printed when you show up so the little uh, Epson mobile printer it's small compact wireless uh, makes it you know life out here a lot easier the Canon also has a little mobile wireless printer uh the canon ip 110 or 100 or something like that uh now them little the little small printers like that are pricey uh that epson was like 240 the canon i think is like 240 250 so they're a little pricey but they're worth it in a pinch uh when you need to print stuff out on the road so it's a nice little thing to have you know keeping your truck so anyway I'm going to go wait until these guys get back from lunch, get that other tractor jumped off, and we'll get them loaded up, chained down, straps across the uh, buckets, and hit the road. I was hoping to be out of here already, but, you know, it is what it is. I had to wait on paperwork. In the meantime, I'm waiting on paperwork. Guys went to lunch. So, anyway, I'll let y'all hear something. Be right, right back here. Oh, okay. This, this will show it too. Okay, like we got zero. All right, three, three, three seven, four, three, four, three. one, four, yeah. and nine, five, five. So that's not it. Three, four, four, two. I don't think that's it. See the big these are the big ones, they are uh the H's, so you're not getting H's, you're getting the small ones okay. like that size. Okay. What's well, uh I'll call I'll call out the number to you. Alright. Three four one four? Three three four one four, yep. That's one? Alright. Hop in. Alright. Three, four, one, four, okay. All right. Stop. Mm -hmm. All right. Okay. So before you ever start, you want to make sure it's in neutral. This is your forward and reverse, right? Okay. okay. That'll be neutral. Okay. Your parking brake is up. Okay. That's your gear. Uh, one, two, three, four. Okay. Throw it in neutral. Find a neutral for it. All right. All right. Uh, Start the key. Uh, you press the clutch. This is the clutch. Start the key. All right, now you want to raise that bucket. That's your lever to raise the bucket. Right here? Yep. Pull back, it raises it up. All right, so now you're going to want to put that in one. Release the parking brake. Put your foot on the brakes. Put this in reverse. Pull it back. All right, come back just a hair. You're gonna wanna watch this so you don't hit that. All right, now put it in forward. Nope, nope, you leave that, in, just leave it in one. 
Put that in forward. One more. That's neutral. There you go. And then just uh, kick it, kick it to the left. You just want to make sure you're going to clear that. You don't hit it. All right. I just go straight through there. So another thing, you're gonna to wanna to look at your paperwork, right? You okay. either got, uh, are you are you delivering to one stop or two stops? Two stops. Two stops. I'm gonna put that one on the end, that one, that first one. The one, yeah, your your first delivery, okay. whether it's one or two, yes, you wanna put them at the end. Okay. And throw that, uh, the last stop at the very front. You just I just just park it back here somewhere where you can you know you can get to it and get it up on the ramp. Yeah, them two are mine and then I got one up there that's got a dead battery on it. Alright, press clutch in, brake, throw it in neutral. Throw that in neutral. Pull your parking brake up. And then uh, lower your bucket. All right. That's it. All right. So like I said, parking brake, neutral, mm -hmm. neutral. Start it. Raise and your bucket. Raise the bucket. Yeah. But okay. I'll, I'll help you out some more because okay. we'll be loading at the same time. Yes, sir. Uh, so yeah, just find your tractors. Okay. Pull them over here All right. and throw them in order. And like you said, okay, yeah. When I get when I get ready to load, load that last one. On load the, your last drop at the, the at the front. One to come out. Okay. All right. I think I got. Thank All right. you. Hey, if you need any more help, come get me. Okay, thank you. Man. Not a problem, bud. Like I said, it's all it's the blue ones. You're not getting cases. Okay. You're getting New Hollands. So, like I said, help folks out. Be considerate. Uh, the trucking industry, you know, there's a lot of assholes in the trucking industry, right? I'll admit it uh, if no one else will but that is one thing I find a lot of e even though there's a lot of shit talking and a lot of uh, you know oh he drives a Volvo or he drives a plastic truck or there, there's still a lot of good people out here that uh, help out I try to be one of them when I can uh, a lot of stuff I do wish I, you'd see more of is uh, help at the truck stops. Uh, I see it all the time. I, like yesterday, for instance, when I stopped at TA in Virginia, I come around the curb, pull up to, uh, pull up to, well, I, I come around the curb and had to stop because there's a truck trying to back in. And he was having playing hell trying to get back in and the truck behind him or you know in the spot next to uh where he was trying to back into the guy was just sitting in the driver's seat watching him like it looked like he was waiting on the other driver to back his truck into him you know i i don't know <laughs> it just needs to be more people that helps out you know i, I stopped got out and helped him back in did what I could, got him in, you know, on top of that, so I could get out of the truck stop faster because I was waiting on him, right? But I don't know. Wish more people would help out, but there there is a lot of good people out here. So I'm not saying that everyone's out here is assholes, but there can be a few. <laughs> anyway, the guy just showed up. So I'm gonna show him my paperwork get that one tractor drop, uh, jumped off, and then get these suckers loaded. Holler at y'all later.
pain inside, don't wanna feel it. So I pour up inside my cup and I just sit till I can't feel it. I know it won't solve my problem, but I know it makes a difference. One more sip and I'ma face it. Out my body when I'm tempted. I told her one more, she hit me, say you quit or she get pain. Yeah, yeah. I don't want pain no more, I don't want no more pain I ain't gon' see no way, look at that with no pain See the rain coming down but it is not purple today Came a long way from stacking and rolling that change And all I ever wanted was some real love Then I ice it on my heart, I watched it build up Alright, we are loaded Chain down, I think we're good uh, So, buckets are strapped I got a chain there. Put one here and here, being that this one's on the top deck. The other one's strap, chain, chain in the back. Through there. And then these go right over there. And a half inch chain in the back. Susie Bob the Builder And I feel like I don't wanna feel it So I pull up inside my cup And I just sip till I can't feel it I know it won't solve my problem But I know it makes a difference One more sip and I'ma face it